So we've pro <laughs> Hey beauty junkies, it's Jen, and today I have my work wifey with me, Isabel. We work together in the digital team and she is the resident vegan at Mecca HQ, and today she's gonna show us through some of her favorite vegan products. So we've both prepped our skin with the Touch of Water Cream and the Hourglass Mineral Veil, and now we're just gonna get into our brows. We're both going to be also using the Hourglass Arch Brow Pencil. Jen, have you used the um, Hourglass Arch Brow before? Yes, I've been using it for years, but I had no idea it was vegan. Yeah, lots of, lots of my favorite products before I was vegan, mm -hmm. I didn't even realize that they were. So now we're going to go in with the Born This Way range. So Jen and I are both using the Born This Way foundation as well as the newly released Born This Way concealer. And the Born This Way range is great because it's not only vegan of course, but it's oil free and it's got the coconut water um, and hyaluronic acid. So it's great for hydrating the skin. So is this brush vegan as well? Yeah, um, all the hourglass brushes are actually vegan. So they're made from like really high quality synthetic fibers. Mm -hmm. So you still get um, the same really nice finish, but um, obviously vegan. I love this foundation. It's quite full coverage and it's just a really nice natural skin finish. Yeah, it's not too matte, but it's oil free so you don't have to worry about that shine throughout yeah. the day. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna get started on foundation. I mean, I'm about to concealer. Just gonna use the Urban Decay Optical Blurring Brush, my favorite foundation brush for a couple of years now. So same as Hourglass, all the Urban Decay brushes are vegan as well. All right, so now to set, um, I'm using one of the Ilia brushes. It's super soft, really nice and fluffy, great for all over. And the RMS Unpowder, which is a really nice setting powder because it's super natural. You don't look like powdery or chalky mm -hmm. at all. So now bronzer. This yes. is the Ciate South Beach bronzer. And you're using? Um, I'm using Palm Island because I'm a little bit fairer than Jen, <laughs> as you can probably tell. This brush is really soft too. Yeah. Do I need more? Maybe a bit more bronzer on this side. So blush up next. Mm -hmm. um, so the one that I've chosen out for you is the Mecca Max um, Golden Glow. As of August, Mecca Max is 100% vegan. Mm -hmm. So give that one a go. Cool. And you're using? I'm going to use one of the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Blushes mm -hmm. um, in the shade Incandescent Electra. So not all shades of this blush are vegan, but this one is. So obviously it's a massive deal for Mecca Max to go vegan. Mm -hmm. I think they heard all the customers calling out for it yes. and lots of brands are starting to kind of follow suit. I know mm -hmm. Hourglass has pledged to go vegan by 2020, which yep. is really cool. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, it's a pretty exciting time for us vegans. So next up's highlight, one of our favorite mm -hmm. steps, I would say. Yes. Um, this one again is from Ciate. So Ciate does quite a few vegan products, so they're a good one to check out. Should I pop some on yes, you maybe? Yes, <laughs> So what makes a product vegan is um, no animal products or animal byproducts um, within the product. What are examples of animal byproducts? Um, so something like honey would be an animal ah, yeah. byproduct. Mm -hmm. Um, beeswax can sometimes be in lip products, like mm -hmm. a lipstick, ah, yep, yep. Um, and honey sometimes in skincare. So now that we've done our base, mm -hmm. um, maybe let's move on to the eyes. First, primer. The Urban Decay Primer Potion um, is vegan, obviously. So let's both pop some of that on our lids. We're gonna go in with the bronzer that we used on our face, just as a nice crease shade mm -hmm. before we um, pop some sparkle on our lids. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm just going to use the Mecca Max um, smudger brush and just take some of that bronzer underneath. All right, so now for the fun part, mm -hmm. we're going to do a bit of glitter on the lid. So I'm using the Hourglass Scattered Light Shadow in Foil and I've picked out for you the Mecca Max Illuminati Cream Shadow in Spotlight. Mm -hmm. This is so fun. I always thought vegan products would be like a really natural kind of look. Yeah, no, you can get a kind of, yeah, pretty dramatic look with vegan. Yeah. Alrighty, so we're gonna do a bit of an inner corner mm -hmm. highlight now because we didn't have enough glitter. Um, and I'm going to use the Illuminati uh, shade that Jin used on her lids. Mm -hmm. And you're gonna use one of the new Mecca Max um, Starlet eye pen glow, pencil. Uh, glow Pencil. This pencil is such a good idea. It's so easy to do your inner corner yeah, highlight. Yeah, and you can use it on your Cupid's bow and the bridge of your nose and your cheeks. Maybe I'll do that then. Mascara next? Yes. Yes, okay. Uh, so um, I've picked out two mascaras, two of my faves. One's mm -hmm. an all-time fave of mine and one's a bit of a newcomer. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to use Better Than Sex. Um, and I picked out the Caution Mascara from Hourglass for you. Do you want to know a fun fact about the Better Than Sex mascara? Mm, tell me. The um, wand of the brush is actually modelled on Marilyn Monroe's waist to hip ratio. So that's oh, why really? it's got the Hourglass shape. Oh, 
Okay, so to finish off the look, I think a bit of lipstick's in order. Mm -hmm. I've chosen us out two of the um, Too Faced Cocoa Butter Lipsticks. I've got Skinny Dipping. What have you got there? Powder about it. Nice. Beautiful. Last step is setting spray, of course. Mm. So true, 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 true. Tried and tested all lighter setting spray. You want me to set you? Yes. Okay, close your eyes. Mm -hmm. Okay, to myself. I didn't know this was vegan either. Mm. So there you go. Those were some of my favorite vegan picks from Mecca. Um, hope you enjoyed. Please let us know in the comments what your favorites are and don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.